as a result of my father sexually abusing me. I was pregnant a total of four times with one abortion. I have three children with my father. I was 16 years old when I became pregnant with my first daughter. I was 21 years old when I was pregnant with my second daughter. 24 years old with my third daughter. He used to mark down my period cycles and I was late. I was shocked and I was happy, but I was confused as well. When I gave birth to my first child, it was very scary. It was intense. They asked who the father was. I said I didn't know. The sexual abuse continued during the pregnancies. He raped me, but he would not beat me as much. I would still get beat. I would still get my hair pulled. I would still get smacked. One time when I was pregnant with my youngest daughter, I was about seven months pregnant, and he tied my hands behind a chair, put a bag over my head, and just suffocated me. I felt like I died and I came back. My first daughter was born. She was like, you know, my little angel. I just wanted to protect her. She was just my little friend because I had nobody. So all I did was, you know, play with her. I was really happy, but yet I was really sad because I didn't know what was going to, you know, become of us. So you gave birth to three of your dad's, I can't say that word, you, you, mm -hmm. you gave birth to three that means. of this monster's children. Correct. Um, and you had one abortion. Mm -hmm. You're now 38. You have these children who are how old now? 21, 17, and 14. 21, 17, and 14. And you, you say that having a child gave you purpose. That's right. Gave you purpose to exist, survive, get through this. How did it change when you had a child? Changed my well-being as well, being in the house by myself, having nobody else to lean to, to you know, talk to. It was... What would you do to cope? Would you try to make nice with him? Did you... Mm -hmm. Pretend you were yeah. a family? What did you Pretend do? Pretend I was a family trying to be nice, always be on his good side. I, you know, even as far as to having sex or whatnot, you know, I knew that he was going to do it anyway, so I wouldn't, you know, try to fight him off all the time. I would just let him have his way so that way it would be easier and get it over with and go on about my day. As perverse as this sounds, and I, I, I have to ask this because... I want to get everything on the mm -hmm. table because I, I want to help you. Were there times that you convinced yourself that you enjoyed this in any way? Were there times where you found pleasure in a given instance that you thought, well, that was okay? No, I would try to tell myself it was okay, but it never felt okay. That's what I mean. You tried to tell yourself tell well, this was okay mm -hmm. this is like husband and wife right but deep down inside I knew it wasn't okay just like my everyday life I know that <clears throat> my past and my girls are not okay but I have to live as if it's okay